I introduced how to use Bootstrap 4 Carousel in Angular 5 before, but environment of Angular has changed a lot. So this time I will introduce you how to use Bootstrap 4 Carousel in Angular 8. As for how to set Bootstrap 4 from the project creation stage, please see how to set a Bootstrap 4 environment in Angular 8, which I have already provided in YouTube. This time I will proceed by downloading such configured projects from GitHub. Please see the full source code from the contents of the project. First, download the full source code from the GitHub. The URL is https colon slash github.com slash o2 slash ng8 bootstrap 4 carousel. When the page is displayed, click the green chrome or download button on the right. Then, the, the download address will be displayed. So, click the copy icon on the right and copy the address. Open the command prompt, move to a suitable directory, and paste the copied address in the directory the following git chrome. Then, the, down, the download will start. Next, enter the directory of the generated project. Start Visual Studio Code. Type code dot. Once VS Code starts up, press Control back code key to open Tiny Window. Untype npm i to install the required libraries for the project. Here, install GALP locally to backup the full source code at any time. Type npm i gulp. If you do not have GALP installed globally, install it with npm i g gulp beforehand. Next, backup the full source code at this stage. Type gulp dash m initial. The dash m option is a text to add the backup directory name. Here, the first stage backup is specified. At this stage, check if the project can be launched. In the time window, type ngs-o. The browser opens automatically and displays carousel.
Pressing the mouse pointer on the screen will stop the screen transition. The image transition one after another by clicking the right angle bracket icon on the screen. If you click the left angle bracket icon on the screen, the image will transition with in the reverse order. Next, change the cursor display settings. Return to VS Code and open the app.component.ts file. The current setting is that the image transition is every two seconds, but let's change this setting every one second. In the browser, open http column slash localhost column 4200. It is displayed again to confirm that the image has been switched every second. OK. Next, change the cursor display settings every 10 seconds. Return to VS Code and open the app.component.ts file. The current setting is that the, the image transition is every second, but let's change this setting every 10 seconds. In the browser, open Rocker First Cone 4200. It is displayed again. It can be confirmed that image is switched every 10 seconds. Okay. Thank you for your watching.